Good morning, students. Today I am going to show the solutions of it. the questions of exercise 1.2. Here I have already mentioned some basic concepts to be used. These all basic concepts are very very important for you. Now I am going to show the questions. Question number one one the one two solution one fifty six is event number so two is a prime factor. 2 7 is 14, 2 8 is 16, 2 39, it will go by 3, 13. So 156 is equal to 2 to the power 2 into 3 into 13. Question number 3, 300, uh, 3, 8, 2, 5. The sum of the digits is 18. So 3 is a factor of this number. 3 to the 3 1 the 3 3 to the 6 3 7 the 21 3 5 the 15 once again 1 plus 2 plus 7 plus 5 15 so this is the multiple of 3 3 for the 2 1 3 to the 6 3 5 the 15 this is not uh, 4 plus 2 plus 5 equal to 11 which is not uh, is a multiple of 3 therefore it is multiple of 5 because it ends with the digit 5 5 8 is 40, 5, 5 is 25. Now it ends with the 5. So 5 will be its factor, 5, 17. Now. So 3825 equal to 3 to the power 2 into 5 to the power 2 into 17. Now question number 2. 2, 510. Following the same rule, we will find its prime factorization. 2 into 3 into 5 into 17. And 92 equal to 2, in 2 to the power 2 into 23. Now, LCM is the product, LCM is of the two number is the product of the primes with the highest power. So, 2 to the power 1 here, 2 to the power 2, we will take 2 to the power 2, 3 into 5 into 70 into 23. When you will multiply, it will be equal to 2, 3, 4, 6, 0. SCF equal to the product of the common factor, common primes, uh, common prime factors with lowest power. And here 2 is only common prime factor. And uh, uh, low, uh, the power of 2 is 1, this is 2. So we will take 2 to the power 1 is equal to 2. Now, LCM into SCF equal to 2, 3, 4, 6, 0 into 2 equal to 4, 6, 9, 2, 0 and product of the numbers equal to 510 into 92 this is also equal to 4, 6, 9, 2, 0 now, question number 3. One, we have to find LCM and LCF by prime factorization method. 12 equal to 2 to the power 2 into 3. 15 equal to 3 into 5. 21 is equal to 3 into 7. So, LCM equal to the product of the all primes with highest power so 2 to the power 2 3 into 5 into 7 is equal to 420 and SCF equal to the product of the common primes with lowest power and the 3 is the common prime to all the 3 numbers and its lowest power is 3 1 therefore 3 to the power 1 is equal to 3 now question number 4 Question number 4 You already know the product of SCF, LCM and SCF equal to the product of the two numbers This is only true for the two numbers not more than two numbers We know that LCM of two numbers A and B equal to A into B by SCF of two numbers. Therefore, LCM of 306 in 
comma six hundred fifty seven equal to three hundred six into six hundred fifty seven by nine nine three the twenty seven nine four the thirty six the product of these two number two two three three eight five number question. We have to check here the six uh, whether uh, six can uh, check whether six to the power n can end with the digit zero for any natural number or not. Let let us assume that six to the power n and with the digit zero or any natural number n this implies 6 to the power n is divisible by 5 this implies 5 is a prime factor of 6 to the power n but 6 to the power n equal to 2 to the power n into 3 to the power n which does not have 5 as a prime factor prime factor therefore Six to the power n is divisible by five. It is wrong. It is impossible. Otherwise, it is not possible. Therefore, our assumption that it six to the power n ends with the digit 0 is wrong. We can prove that 6 to the power n does not ends with the digit 0 or any natural number n. Now question number 6. Solution. 7 into 11 into 13 plus 13 can be written as 7 into 11, 11 into 13 plus 13 into 1. 13 is the common factor. 13 into within bracket 7 into 11 plus 1 equal to 13 into 78 equal to 1014 now 1014 equal to 2 into 3 into 13 into 13 which has the prime factor which is the product of prime factors that is 2, 3 and 13. Therefore, 7 into 11 into 13 plus 13 is composite. Now, next question. 7 number question. According to question, The smallest
number which is given by both 18 and 12 will be the required number of minutes. Now let us find the LCM of 18 and 12. So 18 is equal to 2 into 3 to the power 2 and 12 is equal to 2 to the power 2 into 3. Therefore, LCM equal to the product of all primes with highest power 3 to the power 2 into 2 to the power 2 is equal to 36. Therefore, after 36 minutes, they will meet again at a starting point. Today only this much. See you in the next class for the rest. Thank you.